Hi everyone, I want to make this small tutorial to show you uh, how to prepare an easy and small uh, centerpiece. Um, I already have all my flowers uh, clean and when I say clean, I'm talking about, for example, if I have to work with roses, look at how pretty and fresh is this rose. Beautiful. Um, I have to cut the stem as long that I need it, thinking on the size of the base and thinking on the um, main flower. The flower is gonna be these hydrangeas I already painted, all of them in dark blue. Because it's for a customer who love uh, his team that is the Met of New York. Um, well, what it has to do, I think at this length is gonna be enough for this base and for those flowers I don't cut an angle, the roses, this is trash and oh, I'm so sad. I had to remove this. There is a tool to clean the roses and remove all the thorns. In this case, I don't need it because I have to work only with the top of the stems and the thorns usually are start from here to the bottom. So I don't need to use that tool. But another day I will show you. Um, I'm gonna use as a filler um, these green bottoms or pompons um, and what I did is they come like this it's just one stem with many flowers but I, I can use in that way because some of them are too long and uh, they will break my oasis so I have to cut one by one maybe I can leave these three together if not then I have to cut it again this is trash and I have this leaf it's called salal salal it is they are too long so I have to cut it and I will show you how to cut the leaf. Okay, I just need uh, a small, uh, yes, a small stem, not too long. So I will use these two. I will remove the top, but I'm not gonna trash the whole top. I'm gonna remove this one, and I, now I have the top of the leaf, the, the top of the stem, sorry, to put in there, okay? And I will keep this one from one, just one stem, I have two uh, pieces. I'm gonna do the same in this one. You see, it's too long for me, so I will cut here. I'm gonna cut it here. And this part is not gonna help me if I keep this leaf, so I will remove. And this is fresh as well. And I have a long stem to work with. Okay, I'm gonna start with the hydrangeas. The hydrangeas is gonna give me the size of the uh, centerpiece. Um, you have to think in this way. Um, well, I can cut it because I know how they will look. If I leave the stem too long, like that, too far from the center, that means that we'll need a lot of hydrangeas. So how, as, as much long, as longer the, the stem, more the flower that you need. So keep the, in this case, it has to be in a small centerpiece. So keep the stem short. And I still, I believe this is too long. So I'm gonna cut it there. Um, one. If the hydrangeas doesn't cover, don't cover the, the whole base, don't worry. They will keep, remember that I, we have to use more flowers and they will keep even uh, growing and growing and getting bigger. Uh, this is this is too long. The bases, I already have the bases done. I did the day before and I put the oasis inside. So um, you have to remember always that the most expensive in, the, in this business is the time. Okay, the other, okay, I like this one. I'm gonna cut it and put it in the middle. This one. Um, okay. Um, sometimes we don't have to work with the idea that everything has to be symmetrical because it's gonna look, it's gonna lose uh, the look of natural. So, um, you know, we have to work with the flowers allowed us to do as well. Start putting this green over here. Um, 
this green is fantastic. This color green is it's like an apple green. Um, it's good because help us to pop up the other colors and also not just to pop up to blend it as well okay the hydrangea has this little problem you have to separate a little bit this is too long the um, the flowers to put a month than the other um, flowers okay I believe that here I will need some leaf mm-hmm Okay, let me put just a few leaves before I finish with the... I want to have this over here. Green. This is too long. In some cases, what I do with these uh, pom-poms, I respect the way they come, but I, I put it uh, separately, not all together, because it's, it's, it's not easy. This is really, really too fat for, for be working in this kind and this size of centerpieces. And it's, it's no, it's no help, helper, no, I don't know how to say. It's like, a, it is hard to work when the stems has that, uh, uh, sizes so it's better if you could buy one one and put it in the same way they come try to copy the way they come so I want to put one more here okay yes and then I'm gonna put one more over here yeah and that's it there is not too much more space. Do you want to come in here? Okay. Too many flowers, right? Okay, be patient. Okay, here we go. That's still long. Please. No, I have to cut a little bit. Okay, I need more green, yes, definitely. I need to cover this white color there. Okay, um, I paint, I dyed the flowers yesterday. Um, and I did uh, an hour ago before I started working and they keep, you know, blooming and showing the, the white color. That's always gonna happen, so uh, do not get upset because of that. Okay. Mm, I want to put something green over here. Okay, okay, yes. Okay, one is done. Let me see. Yes. 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 Uh, one leaf over here. Okay. Um, I have to prepare five more. Okay. I don't like here. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, you see, it has a very natural look and it got really big. Um, so from the size five by five, we get almost <laughs> nine <laughs> by, <laughs> by seven. I want to have something long over here. Okay. Yeah. One ready. I like it. I like the colors. Okay. Let me put it aside. As you see 
here I have all the other bases ready. That's, that's the way you have to work when you have to do more than one. Because if you do only one in your house, it's okay. But if you have to prepare more than one, you have to remember, you need to save time. Well, I'm gonna prepare one more. Um, yes, we have time. Yes, we have, we have only five minutes. Okay, let me bring the flowers. Okay, easy, right? And it looks really pretty. Okay, I hope you can do it. It's really easy. Um, give me one, uh, leave one comment so if you need more help or more uh, tips, uh, I've been, uh, uh, blah, 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 sorry. <laughs> if you need more information or more help, uh, just ask me and I will uh, answer you as soon as you leave the message. Uh, thank you. Now I have to deliver it. Thank you so much.